Good afternoon, Raja parents. This is Mr. Lawson here at Indio High School with our weekly parent preview, and we have so, lots of exciting news to share today, so let's get rolling. First, I want to remind all of you that offices will be closed on Monday and schools will be closed in honor of President's Day. So remember, Monday, no school across the entire district. Also, we want to give a huge shout out to our cross country team. We are so proud of how they did this Friday. We uh, were permitted to have a cross country meet, very small, just us in Shadow Hills. Uh, we weren't allowed spectators yet. We're beginning the process of moving into some of our athletics slowly based on what public health department is allowing. So this was our first. We were very proud. The students wore their masks while they were preparing and uh, cheer kept their masks on. The kids kept their masks on until it was time to run in the actual race. And they did a great job, kept their social distancing and we were very proud. Uh, all of our athletes did a great job, and congratulations, as you see here in the middle, to uh, Jaziri for her third place finish. Way to go, Ra Lady Rajas, and thank you to all of our families who supported us as we launched this very first initiative. You'll see um, I posted 97 pictures online, so you can see all the pictures of our kids. And we look forward to having more information for you. Um, for all of our students, we've been telling them this on the broadcast news every day on our announcements. So remind them to contact their coach. They can call the athletic office at the school or they can email their coaches. Check the web page. I'm uh, beginning to add links on the web page for each one of them to be able to reach their coach if they're interested in being a part of any of those sports. We've been given a little bit more opportunity for athletic conditioning. Remember, we need to do good conditioning before they do any kind of competition. We don't want anyone hurt, and we need to make sure that they have done the proper training and conditioning of their bodies beforehand. We want to keep them safe. And we have a couple more grab-and-go opportunities this week. Tuesday night from 3 to 6, Miss Carstens from the uh, Technical Theater class has uh, bags of materials for students for the second semester assignments. These are students that work behind the scenes normally to put together the lighting and the technical, the sound, uh, all the things that building the set, all the things they do to make our productions work and they learn some great uh, skills for a future trade if they want to go into that area of, of a career. So we have uh, bags for them on Tuesday night. Then on Thursday, the English department has put together the second semester workbooks for our English students. That will be from 3 to 6 on Thursday. Our dance team parents will have a parent meeting Thursday night at 6 o'clock. Our dance coaches are sending out a separate email invitation with the Zoom link to all of the parents that are involved. And then we want to honor all of our honor roll students this semester. We have a very special honor roll drive up celebration 4 o'clock on Friday. We will be mailing uh, information to all the students on honor roll and their parents uh, the first part of the week. Mr. Atkins is taking care of that as our Renaissance advisor and we'll send you information for the directions and what to expect. And don't forget, we still have about 75 to 80 seniors that your deadlines this week. We need to have you uh, fill out that Google form with your height and weight for your cap and gown order to make sure we get the right size for you for graduation coming up. Parents, uh, for the meal service, this is the same flyer I had last week. Please remember to watch. It has information for all three, uh, all the weeks of February. Plus, it gives you some information about fine food banks uh, in the local area. So please double check that with information about our meal service. And a reminder to encourage your students to participate Tuesdays and Thursdays in that early intervention hour with all of their teachers. Uh, they'll find all the information they need in each of their Google Classrooms so that they can be a part of that extra support and extra help. And for all of our seniors and especially our seniors and I, we want to invite our juniors. Every Wednesday we have some special 15-minute um, career chats, college and career chats that are provided by One Future, which is the group all across Coachella Valley that supports helping our students move on to college and career and provides them with some great resources. They're the sponsors of the big college night, that, the college fair that we used to have over at the uh, Agua Caliente Ballroom. This year we had to be virtual because of the pandemic. And so we've got some special events. The next one coming up, of course, 
is this Wednesday night. They have one on FAFSA and college, everything you need to know. The link is listed here. I have it here on the page in English and Spanish. This is going out in our broadcast to students, and I have the links on our webpage, and we're sending this out in an email to our parents and students each week as a reminder. And our PK program, our next session of PK is this coming Tuesday night. We uh, we go all the way till March 12th. Remember, there are six sessions plus the graduation. I am so proud to share with you that 108 parents are involved in our Parent Involvement for Quality Education program. Reminder that our counselors also have Stay Safe resources listed on our webpage to help you and your families to stay safe and to have support and resources for social, emotional, and mental health. Um, you know, there we've had... Uh, Parents call to say, you know, my, my son or daughter's really struggling with how they're feeling about not being able to be out and about, and what can I do? And here we have resources from our school, from our district, from the county, uh, some community resources. Please check those out. And remember on our webpage, we want you to go and visit there. I keep those links updated at the top. Um, and I'll be adding under athletics here to the side, I'm going to be adding the link so that you, your, your son or daughter can click and go right to an email to each of the coaches. If they're interested in being a part, we'll be posting the athletic conditioning schedule and some of those other important pieces of information. Thank you, as always, each and every week for helping us to spread our values as a Rajah family and community. Thank you, all, as always, for helping us to promote positivity, respect, integrity, determination, and excellence in all of our students. We want you to stay healthy, helpful, and calm. Have a great week, and I'll see you on the next broadcast.